Hey everyone, and welcome back to Paranautical Activity. As usual, I have no idea which character to play. I think that I get to play Dynamite now. I I don't know. I'm just gonna go with it, and we're gonna we're gonna say that I'm right. It's gonna be great. So I get the grenade launcher. It's gonna be a wonderful, fun time. Hopefully, we get Blast Shield again. Uh, I know that last time I got Blast Shield with this character, I had a pretty great time. Uh, not that I don't in general have a pretty great time, but you know. Oh come on. Let me show off my sick jumping skills, come on. Alright, so let's see what's in the shop. Do we get anything from it that I want? I mean, I kind of want all of them. Not really super ammo boost, but I kind of want mushroom. An armor box, oh god. I hate that weird thing. It's okay, it'll be fixed. I have faith in Mike Malbec. I don't know if I should. But I do. And that should be that for that room. And then there's our mini boss, so hopefully we'll get a nice free item instead of a not nice free item, I suppose. Okay, so first priority needs to be killing this jerk. Oh really, you didn't die. Oh god. Yeah, okay. Okay. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Just need to shoot upward and we'll be fine. did take a lot of damage, and I should be a little worried, but I should get it all back pretty quickly. The first floor is not difficult. Alrighty then. That gets me at least some armor, and then that gets me a powder keg, so I just doubled the damage of my bombs. Everything is looking quite nice. Now it should only take two hits to kill them. Yep, indeed, it only takes two hits for Gileads now. So we just started off really nicely for this character, and I'm happy about it. And then here's our boss, so I may as well do that right away too. Excellent, we're going to get a double jump right away. Pretty pleased with that too. Not much to complain about with this run besides that I've played badly so far. Okay, they, yep, die really easily. And I get dice. Not that I really think I have anything to reroll, but I might have something to reroll next floor. I also get a battery that I'm not really excited about at all. Wow, how about I don't just die? Because that'd be pretty silly of me. Golden Heart, uh, well I definitely would say that the dice take the uh, top, top billing. So they, they are what I take. Oh, Alright, good to have a double jump. It really does save you a lot. <laughs> okay, so let's grab all the money. I could get 150, but I don't think I care. Like, I don't think that 150 and getting armor, shield lover... I don't know if that's strats. I think that strats are more likely going to be saving up and saving my dice getting good things later. Won't be too long anyway, before I can go get something else. Oh, you're still alive? How did that happen? Who let that travesty of justice pass by freely? Okay. Dead, please. Thanks. All right. Wild card, guess I'll use it. I'm probably invincible. The timer there seems like Onk timer is pretty short. But I'm not concerned. Like I said, we'll go to the next level with all of our stuff still, still on us. Alright. We got... No problem, second floor usually. Pretty simple floor as well. As that is how the first two are. Pretty much just as floors. Not supposed to be hard. Find the boss quickly, so that could be exciting. Okay, you might want to die. Thanks. And then that should be the room. We may as well kill the boss. Skeleto. Well, Skeleto Soul is better for this character than other characters, allowing our bombs to travel straight rather than being affected by gravity. So they'll go exactly where we point them instead of wherever they arc to. 
course, I like Blubber. I do. I really do. But at least we gain something from this, as this character, more than usual. And I could have rerolled it. I'm well aware of that. This time, I didn't forget. This time, I actually kind of want it because it does make my life a little bit easier to deal with. So there we go. Okay, let's go here, find the shop. I like it. I'd really like it if I got the um, flash shield, though. That'd be pretty sweet. Scissors. Okay, I like that. I like that a lot. But I just have to determine if I want to do it now or not. Chain. 500 for the chain. I don't need it. So, reroll everything. Ah, not happy with either of those or any of those either. I do not need the chain with this setup though. I was hoping for more bomb related items that I'd then be able to afford. But I don't want either of those weapons because, uh, you know, I've gotten them recently. Tesla coil is not a bad thing to have, but it's definitely not worth the scissors, and it's just maybe not worth $100 for me right now. Though I'm thinking that I just wait and get nothing or reroll again if I get that lucky, as far as getting another dice. It's weird calling a singular thing dice, but, like, that's what it's called, I believe. Because I'm one of those people that's all about using die properly. Oh my god. Well, alright then. We got another... Dice. There's our reroll. Get hype. Okay, calm down. And we even might get to reroll this, too. See if we want it. Okay, you will die before too long. That'll do it. Oh, I missed. Um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna reroll that as well. And that is hook, which is damage up and it's free, so I'm happy to take that. Come on, more bomb related power ups of some sort. take all of them. Doxy becomes one dollar? Oh no, it's still free. Okay. Oil cans of damage up, winged foot is a speed up. I think that was worth it. So I got two damage ups there. And those should be doubled, I believe. It shouldn't be that, um... It shouldn't be that I get them after. I think that Powder Keg is a, like, later two times multiplier. It's the last thing applied to our bombs damage. I think. So that's pretty good. I'm definitely happy about getting that. I'm a little fast right now. It is nice that I one-shot Tenchi's, which probably lends a little bit of credence to me thinking that it's uh, doubled last, but uh, I don't know the comparison of health for Tenchi's versus Gilead's. But we did end up with a pretty good set of items out of this level, and we're not doing badly for loot remaining afterwards, and we're still gonna do a few more rooms. So I quite like it. Okay, kill you. Boom. Grab the loot. I didn't miss any, did I? Doesn't seem so. And of course, the faster I am, the more bunny hopping is noticeably beneficial for my speed. Alrighty then. Alrighty then, we can go to the third level, and we're in pretty good shape, both monetarily and every other way. A little sad I didn't get Tesla Coil, but at the same time I'm not really that mad. Doxy changes the sounds of us being hit, by the way. So now, when we get hurt, it'll be Doxy doing the... the ow. Oh, you... out of the way, and just one more. No big deal. Must grab the loot that doesn't exist from that. Yeah, I really like one-shotting Tenchi's. Sadly, we won't be dealing with them for long, so I won't be one-shotting things for that long. Alright. Another floor that I'm going to do every level, or every room of. So I'm not really worried about 
where I'm going right now. There is no reason that I won't do every room, because no room is going to be particularly difficult. So I'm going to get to him. Pathing's not important. All right, uh, that way. Dead end, no big deal. Armor I like, because I haven't been getting much of that. I haven't been getting much of anything health related. So it's good to get that handled. Oh, I actually hit that through the floor. Fine with me. Oop. Cool. Let's see what's in the shop. We've got 300 bucks, it's not bad. Mystery chest, health box, and chain. I mean, mystery chest is two mystery boxes. I'm not against buying that. In fact, by not against, I mean I'm most likely going to buy that. If I get enough money. Which, well, who knows. I don't. That is who. Maybe you do, but... I hope I get to. 500 is a lot, though, especially to get for the rest of this level. So I'm not convinced it'll happen, but I'm gonna do my best. This is a good level for loot, though. A good room, rather. So maybe it'll work out. This one's also not bad. The more enemies, the merrier. Head stomped you, you fool. Uh, we didn't get a lot, though. Fight the boss. We still have a mini-boss. We still have rooms. We're gonna get a speed up for this. Get a few extra bombs in there. Omni is not a very difficult fight. Perfect. Wow, you dropped like no freaking loot, Omni. You don't understand. I need I need this loot to get happiness from that mystery chest. I have faith in the mystery chest. What I don't have faith in at the moment is my ability to buy it. That should kill you. Eventually I will kill you. Eventually being right now. Armor, thank you. I do need to start building up that health that I haven't had the opportunity to build up. Another good loot room. Ow, it's my fault that I got hit there. That was dumb dodging. And we're just not getting loot from things that should be giving more loot. So the chance of getting 90 bucks from the boss, mini boss here, pretty much non-existent. Okay. But I'll try. Okay, that almost hit me. Easy peasy boss fight though. Well, I now have flight, so there's that. Because when you get both double jump items, you get flight. But I didn't get enough for the double mystery box. That sucks. And flight allows me to go really fast thanks to the way bunny hopping works where each jump increases your speed a bit. But yeah, I guess we're out of here. Because I definitely can't afford chain. Alright. Okay, that's fine. I'm faster than them. Here's a bunch of loot, which is good. I wish I had more opportunities at mystery chests. But I like when, like, mini-bosses give you mystery chests, because it's just two items instead of one. And they're the same amount of random, just as likely to be something that you want as... Well, I guess technically it's twice as likely to be something you want as it normally is with a mini-boss, since it's two items instead of one that are equally random. Okay, so I totally want piece of eight, and I also totally want compass, but we're gonna take piece of eight, speed and damage up. Gonna fight the mini boss, see where that takes us. Oh, that's annoying. At least it doesn't take much to kill, because if I hit it four times, it's dead with this setup. Lighthouse, alright. Wild card, sure. I'll use that eventually. Uh, Lighthouse makes it so that when we're down to one health, we get five armor. And it can activate as often as we can get a red heart above one heart. Or a heart above red, above one. So it's basically scapular, except not once per room, and instead, um, 
once per getting enough hearts to have more than one. Come on. Up. Please. Thank you. It's expensive, and it's abusable too if you have the right setup. I just uh, don't often have the right setup. And by don't often, I mean I've never farmed it before, but I think I had the opportunity once. Shell is the opportunity, by the way. If you have shell with lighthouse, you can you can do it. And hearts, of course. You need heart drops, but yeah. Okay. You should die. Excellent. Let's see if I can. I cannot get both of them. Okay, good. Before it got a shot off, I killed it, and then that kills that. See, now money's piling on plenty quickly. It would pile on after I already got every, uh... After I already left the last level, where I actually could have used that money for that double mystery box. Okay. Golden scissors. Alright, well then let's use the wild card. Onk again, it seems. Keep jumping. The fact that I've gotten flight so many times in a row is actually astounding. That's so unlikely. I get it like never. And now with more items, I'm getting it more. So I, I just have some crazy luck right now. All right, let's fight the boss. Ons, all right. That gets us a health up and some armor. Alright, easy peasy. Get dead. Two hearts and five armor. Health is unfilled, but usually it drops enough that you get the health anyway. With flight, I really don't worry much about lava and acid rooms, because I can just jump whenever I have a problem. Now, I did that to myself. So we'll see how much money I end up with at the end of the floor. Then we'll pay another visit to the shop and see if I want to cut the prices or not. It's not like I have to use the scissors immediately. There's nothing that states that or makes that the case. Alright. Deftly dodged. Okay, so I've been to every room that I would have any interest in being in. Now it's just for money. Another wild card. Another onk, probably. Whatever. It's fine. It could be not the onk. I just don't know what all of the timers are. What I do know is that it wasn't something important like a, a dice. A reroll would have been kind of cool. Alright, let's stop by here now. Okay, 500's not happening this level, but I could get the compass, which would be pretty nice. Oh my. Hello, enemies. I did just murder most of them immediately, which was pretty nice. Cool. Everything is indeed dead. And then the last room is this room again. You know what? Ouch. Ow, I didn't jump soon enough. And then I threw a bomb instead of shooting a bomb. That was pretty silly of me. Alright, so let's cut the prices. And then get this nice compass. Shows us the full map for the floor. And now we just need to go all the way back to... Oh my god, I did that. That did just happen. Now I just have to go back to the boss. I'm not worrying about super weapon ammo because it'll come back to me anyway. I'll get it quickly. Alright. See how things go. Alright. So we're near the mini boss. There's a trap room. Sadly, there's also a ceiling monkey in here. I think I killed it. Which is a 
Well, all that matters, I guess, with ceiling monkeys. It died somehow. Good. Room should not be bad. Could be, though. Too many things to not get caught in. Rooms are open. We're good. If I stay at 10 armor, I'm happy. Fight the mini boss since that's why we're here. Oh, hello. Okay, let's see if you will just die. Maybe. Good. Let's kill you. If I don't want this, I should make sure to try and wait and see if I get a reroll. Alright. Yeah, you know, I'd rather try and reroll that, but that one isn't even like something that I would just take and then decide, oh, I wish I hadn't taken that because I got a reroll. That's just something that I would have to take and I'd be able to switch it again if I wanted to and not commit to it. Please die. Oh, you did. Good, thank you. Okay. Easy peasy. EZ PZ. Uh, let's go for the trap room, then we'll go for the other, the shop and the boss room. Okay, good. Cool. Good, and... What? Is the floor, like, lava or something? What kind of trap room is this? What? Alright, whatever, man. I'll just... I'll take it. Oh, this is a bad room. Why did I just walk into it? I could have done a completely different room and been fine. However, it has been done. Well, must understand that I am simply not excited about any of these things. You get a damage up here though, that's good, and poison damage. It is nice that we, we one-shot each of the egg sacks. That is always something nice that I like about this boss when I have to fight it. If I can easily and quickly kill the egg sacks. Alright, so let's... Get that done. Gives me a battery. Get the fang. Let's get the fang. And uh, I think that I want to just get out of here. Yeah. When did I get hot feet? Would I rather have hot feet? No, I wouldn't. All right, uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Yeah, we're good. Okay, let's see what this level has to offer. Shop immediately, I like it. And it's the only linking room to the shop, so I'm gonna do it regardless. Uh, is that? No. I just thought I saw dice, which would have been pretty sweet. What do we have here? Trigger finger, why not? But I don't want the Genghis soul. Turns my jumps into flips that change the uh, gravity for me, where I can go onto the ceiling like the ceiling monkeys do. You can't beat them, join them, as they say. Uh, I would like to not. I would like to not join them. It's not that good for most situations. Oh, cool! Those die in one hit. Who knew? Wait, did I? Does that damage up enough? Did I insta kill things? I'm so happy. Gilead's dying in one hit is like that's when I know I have a run that I like a lot. Alrighty then. That is how you know you've made it in the world when you can kill Gilead's in one hit. 
mini boss. Easy peasy. Or EZ PZ. Z just sounds so wrong to me. I can't. It, it's just hard to do. I can't do it. I'd definitely rather have assault, by the way. Oh, God, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, well, sea legs is happening. Alright. Okay, we're, we're gonna be fine. I'm a little scared now, though. Okay, let's uh, not run into our own bombs. Okay, we're good. Trying not to move too much. Alright. Gotta go this way. Alright, I messed up a couple times there. Alright, that should kill you. Excellent. Oh wow, that killed that? Sweet. Okay. I could just not take sea legs, but that's like not... I don't know, that's just like... pop out. Okay, seriously? You know what? You know what, strats? You know what's strats? Okay, can we do this? Come on, we can do this. Strats. Oh god! I feel I've been cheated. Let's just stay upward. There we go! Okay, dice, I like. I want the damage up. Oh god, that was scary. Okay, so we go this way. We go this way. We go this way. Wait, I skipped the shop. Uh, yeah, let's get Adderall. 15% speed up, why not? Tesla coil allows us to have 200 charge for our super weapon. And then I just leave, haha. -ha. Wow, I glitched through the wall a little bit. Hmm, yes, well. Hey, I like this spawn. Okay, calm down. Just don't move too much at once, and nothing is a problem anymore. Uh, you're still alive. Okay, good. More power-up drops. Sure, why not? This is gonna be a really long floor, I must, I must say. Okay, uh, I missed that one, obviously. Alright, I'm trying to move in very, very short bursts. Because I'm scared. Okay, okay, we're going that way. Into the same room, essentially. And by essentially, I do mean the same room. Just in a slightly different location on the floor. So I missed that, but it still hit. Oh my. Okay, let's, uh, wow, these are just brutal rooms. Sadly, this one actually has to be done. And it has to be done after the room I just did, too. So basically, that's kind of brutal. But it's cool, I guess. Okay. Okay, I need, oh god. Okay. Okay. I basically fly by tapping. Ooh. Well, this is a little insane. Okay. Well, someone wanted to see this. I'm sure a few people wanted to see this. Okay, I can't deal with Nazis right now. Ooh. This is, uh... This is what you get when you have Adderall Runner and, uh... Sea Legs. This is what happens. Oh my. Okay, this room should be easy. Suddenly my speed feels incredibly manageable. Oh my god. Oh, how did you live? How did you do that? Okay, uh, you know, things are a little worrisome, I guess. After all, uh, so I wanna go this way. Okay, it's this room again. Just need to shoot the Nazis fast. Oh, not like that, though. 
That should be it. Yes. I need health, and I need armor and stuff. Okay, let's uh, avoid all the things. Let's shoot the Gileads now. Oh boy. Okay, where did this Scorch come from? I just had to bat him in the face, because it was easier than using bombs with sea legs right now. Oh, this room sucks. Oh, nope, activated. Okay, let's shoot that downward. I missed. Okay, all should be well. Okay, I'm so much faster than you that I need to slash you in the face. You know what, you two. Doors are open, excellent. See what we get in here. Uh, let's reroll them. Alright then. Guess let's get that. And that. Let's get our assault here. And let's fight the final boss. Doubled fire rate and damage from assault, so... Uh, I'm causing the lag right now. Those particles and things. Okay, let's uh, turn off the slideshow. And that was that. Good win. Freaking sea legs is just too insane. But we managed. Oh, okay. No, I thought that I was stuck for a second. And I went in the wall and couldn't uh, end it for a moment until I got out of the wall. No, that didn't happen. But that was a fun run. Soon the update will be out for everyone. Soon. TM. And then you can all play it. And I'll play even more of it, and it'll be a little bit um, more fixed, because there are a couple of issues. Not very many, but a couple. Yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.